a decade at the Whetstone led sword dancer Tito Tsai to second place in Europe's largest talent competition last year. His performance featured a three meter long 12 kilogram flaming sword deftly handled with gentle artistry. After returning to Taiwan, Tsai shared the source of his persistence in an exclusive interview with FTV. Let's take a look. Each hand grips two swords as another twirls over his shoulders. He then trades them for a pair of flaming blades. For the French edition of the Got Talent TV series, Tito's Tsai was as perfect as they come. Tsai's back bears all 12 kilograms of the three meter long flaming sword. Sharing the stage with his wife, Li Ziyi, the two earned a standing ovation from the judges and audience of La France A and Coriable Talent, winning second place. There was a lot to be done before France's got talent, because I only had a little over 10 days to prepare. I knew I wanted to create something with a really special Eastern flair. I added four drums to the background to represent Taiwan's religious processions. The choreography, staging and music are all original creations. While withstanding the heat of the flames, Tsai's performance features a striking combination of acrobatics, martial arts, circus and modern dance. My team and I created this performance during the preparation period, which only exists in Taiwan. If my mum hadn't encouraged and supported me so much while growing up, and if my wife weren't part of my team, I couldn't have made it this far. Tsai began sword dancing when he was 19. Even though he once had to go to the hospital after a sword fell on his foot, Tsai said he is just as determined to promote the art. No matter if it's sword dancing or fire dancing, the main point isn't that it's dangerous or scary. The idea is to present a different kind of beauty. Tsai vows to keep creating new performances and opportunities to show Taiwan to the world.